good morning from Agra. My name is Ivana and we are off to have some bed eye at a restaurant that one of you guys recommended me on Snapchat. <laughs> so cute. I just ordered an Ola cab. I could have walked to Deviram at the restaurant. But this pollution is so bad. My throat is immediately hurting again. I just can't walk here. Like, it's too bad. Oh man, I so love Ola cabs. And this is where we're going Deviram Sweets and Restaurant. Here we are, and this is what I'm supposed to eat. Bed eye? Bed eye. Let me eat this. Ooh, it's good. Costs literally almost nothing. Two bed eye. So I thought it was like puri baji, but no, I think it is just very different. So we got two kind of crunchy puri thingies, some sauce and curd. It's delicious. Let me try this. It's really good. Wow. <laughs> wow. It's super crunchy. It's definitely not like puri bhaji. I think this is better. Mm. Nom, 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 nom. I might get more. So good. Thank you for sending me here. I am now at David Ram Sweet Chef Restaurant. Guess who's getting two more? Om nom 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 nom. So these things, they are way, way, way crunchier than puris. I like it. This one, this side. Hello, this side. Okay. I don't know, people are getting annoyed by me putting the food on the counter. Maybe they feel I'm not eating as fast enough. This was freaking delicious. I totally would have missed out on this without you guys. Thank you so much. Okay, let me check with the restaurant if I can get some takeout because I really don't want to go out for food later. Yes, they have takeout and they have paneer dosa. What do you like? Yes, mama got a dosa. Paneer dosa. Nom 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 nom. Now, I also want to buy some sweets. So this one, this one. Cheat. What? Which one? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so many. Yeah, Devi Ram Alwai. Which one is good? Yeah. This sweet man is helping me. Which one is good? Okay, no. This one is good. This one is good? This one. Okay, I will have that one. Thank you. Yes. Indian sweets. <laughs> no. I am back in the room and I'm really rethinking, rethinking Delhi because. The pollution over here is already so bad. My throat started hurting as soon as I got out. I just asked Kabir, like, please, please, can you help me make a decision? Like, I don't know what to do. So he's like, no, go to Rishikesh because spending a week in Delhi right now, it's just so bad for your health. And uh, I loved Rishikesh last year. It's like a six hour bus ride. So I'm gonna check for a bus and maybe spend like two days in Delhi. And then like four days in Rishikesh and then come back and take a flight to Kochi. And Kochi will be amazing, I know that already. But oh, I feel so sad. I was so much looking forward to Delhi food and everything. But my health, I don't think my health will allow me to stay a week in Delhi. Hello again, it is 4 p.m. I took a wonderful nap and I feel better. Also, I think I for sure going to go to Rishikesh and spend off instead of uh, spending the whole week in Delhi. On a more positive note, let's try some sweets. Nom 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 nom. So let's start out with this one. Okay, 
I need your help. You need to tell me in the comments what each sweet is because I have no freaking idea. So the old man told me this sweet is really good. It's actually um, a big rectangle. So this is half of it. It smells deliciously cardamomy. Mm. Mm. I love the combination of crumbliness and chewiness. Like it tastes like there are raisins in it, but there aren't any raisins in it. Mm. Mm. There's also butter involved and mm, the cardamom flavor is also quite subtle. If I have to choose between this one and so and bhakti, I would choose so and bhakti because I like the texture more, like the the berry floss or cotton candy texture of so and bhakti is the best ever. But the flavor, the taste of this one is quite comparable to it. Okay, the next one is this little ball. Oh, mmm, mmm. Okay, it tastes very peanutty. Ooh, this is good. Mm. Also, super crumbly. You think that it's basically a big ball of sugar and peanuts? But I don't think so. I think there's also some dough involved, which makes it super crumbly. Ooh. This is good. I've never tasted an Indian sweet like this before. Like peanutty. Or maybe it's cashew, I don't know. But it tastes more like peanuts. The final sweet, it's super pretty. I love these kinds of shapes. And yeah, it looks very creamy. It's quite big actually. Like I have a big nose. This sweet is quite big. <laughs> mm. Mm. It's definitely different than the other two. This one's a lot more creamy, not that crumbly. There's not really a big flavor coming up. This one's my least favorite because the plainness. And this one, out of these three, is my favorite. Like the little ball. Mm. I'm going to finish that one. Freaking good. It's also very sweet. I think there's a lot of sugar involved. <laughs> mm. Right now, I'm just gonna edit videos and then later. I'm gonna eat the paneer dosa. Time for some more non pour and so we got a dosa over here. Really, really, truly a dosa is so much better when it's fresh. But still, it's good, it's good. And this was a, this was, this is a paneer dosa. Over here, I don't know what this is. Something with potatoes and paneer, I guess. And the coconut chutney, that's what it's all about. Take a piece of the dosa. Mm -hmm. Come on, yeah, really, this is so much better when it's fresh. And then take a little bit of this. And dip it in the coconut chutney. This is by far the best coconut chutney I've had. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Wow, that coconut chutney. I, you can already see it. Like It's so very well mixed and it smells so nice and garlicky and coconutty. Mm. life that's basically today just eating sleeping and editing videos mm. oh crap houston we have a problem you see all this money what do you what what catches your eye when you look at these notes it's mother flipping 500 rupee notes Today, it was announced that these will not be valid anymore as of tomorrow. Brilliant, brilliant. Banks are closed. No, tomorrow the banks are closed. The ATMs are closed for two days, I think. I'm traveling to Delhi tomorrow. I have to pay for my hotel, so I hope they will be accepting my money. Flipping 500 rupee notes because I can't take any money out, out of the ATM. Uh, usually I have trouble with um, places accepting my international credit card here in India and I don't know how I'm gonna eat more I have I have a hundred rupee note but I need money to pay Ola to get to the train station and <sighs> why 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 give so little notice like I understand that it's like to stop crime and money laundering and stuff like that but like give me two mother flipping days to change money 
I I don't know. I don't know what what I'm going to do. <sighs> Anyways, thanks for the heads up, guys. Because honestly, I wouldn't have read this news without your comments. And well, actually, there's nothing I can do about it because it's already 12 a.m. and it's done. Okay, when you're watching this, I've survived it, but this is not fun. I don't, at this point, when I'm filming this, I don't know how I'm gonna fix this. This is India. Everything fixes itself. Otherwise, I'm gonna, you know, sleep in the streets or something. Well, stay tuned to see how this will be resolved. Tomorrow we are traveling to Delhi. So I listened to him screaming for 50 minutes Really? Really? You're gonna come back? So if you would like to travel along, click that subscribe button and yeah, if you like the food porn today, put a thumbs up. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time. Bye!